Hello again, I am Snuff Anybody, and uh, I'm back here with part 10 of my 6 photo odyssey. Today I will be having a look at the special Snuff. Let's have a closer look at the Snuff. Okay, the Snuff looks like this. It is black Snuff, uh, the grind is again finely milled. Uh, is the moisture level is again a bit above medium uh, there is uh, it's kind of crystally but still a bit over medium this I think will be very easy to take But let's have a whiff and see how it works in the nose. Okay, in the tin. I smelled something... Slightly incense -y. Sweet. A wee bit musky. Something in the line of mint. Yeah, that's the tin notes, but uh, I'll have a pinch and see what I get up in the nose. Ooh. Oh, eucalyptus. Oh, very nice. Nice cooling sensation. Very different from mental. Very pleasant, very silky in the nose, and as I expected, very easy to take. There is something kind of uh, moist, woody in this scent. Uh, a bit like wet tropical rainforest if that makes sense to say it like that there is also something musky but nothing of the incense that I got in the in the tin and nothing of the mint there isn't a whole lot of tobacco scent to this snuff only very very faintly this is a very pleasant snuff on congestion in the nose there is a bit of nicotine to this one uh, on a scale from 1 to 10 where 1 is nothing and 10 is called the nurse I'm gonna rate this 6 and because of the fine milling it is instantaneously delivered and I like that. Uh, on a scale from 1 to 10, where 1 is an awful snuff, and 5 is a, a nirvana snuff, oh, this is a very nice snuff. I'm going to rate it 4. This is a snuff I could use uh, most days, maybe all day. Uh, I think this should be rated as a med uh, medicated snuff. This has all the effects of it, and uh, a medicated snuff should not uh, does not necessarily need to uh, contain menthol, as far as I'm concerned. A super snuff you should try. Join me again for part eleven of this uh, wonderful six photo odyssey. Goodbye. See you there.